live in the Midwest, grow up, I work as an insurance salesman. That would have been a shame. For that, I would be sorry. But not for what I did. You know, there was this long, long period where I was Blackie Dammit and Anthony was Blackie Dammit's kid. And then it came to the point <laughs> where I'm Anthony Kiyosu's son. I mean, father. It's... There was a time where he became the dad in a way. And then it, he is now. He's bought me two houses now, big expensive houses, not just little old houses. And, you know, big cars for Christmas and Andy Warhol paintings. And, uh, you know, he's, ex he's spent a lot of money on me. <sighs> he couldn't be any better. He's my hero. Is he, is he the main relationship in your life? Yes. Tell me about that. I can't. I can't talk right now. Because all the women in my life have been transitional and ephemeral. Uh, you fall in love and you fall out of love. You never fall out of love with yourself. And obviously I never will. And I'm sure he feels the same way. You want to hand me the Kleenex? <laughs> yeah, it's right behind you. Just hand me a couple of those, will you? God, please, better wish you saw. I can't admit to know it.